Alright. Let's do this. Hello viewers. Another beautiful day. Yeah. Hope your five senses work. Health and strength is good. Or excellent. Alright. So the Steam Deck is about to get official 1200p screen support. Hmm. Okay, Valve GitHub page shows that the Steam OS is getting support for the H for the Deck HD screen upgrade without the need of need to install third party patches. Hmm. Yeah, Valve is at it again. So remember you can replace the uh, remember you could have replaced this the screen on your Steam Deck with that uh, with that uh, Deck HD screen. Yeah, Valve Valve has been working on some updates for it. Hmm. Look listen to this. Valve is working on implementing support for a 1200p Steam Deck sc screen in Steam OS, meaning you won't have to install third-party patches yourself to get it working. The screen in question is the Deck HD, which was originally launched as a as a replacement for the Steam Deck screen in 2023, and increase and increase the deck resolution a much sharper 1920 by 1200, while also reducing glare and improving the color accuracy. Says since then, Valve has released the best handheld gaming PC right now, in the form of the Steam Deck OLED. But while the screen on the this device offers a big improvement in image quality over the standard Steam Deck screen, it is still stuck at the same 1200 by 800 resolution. That's not necessarily bad, though, as we noted when the Deck HD first launched, the Zen 2 based CPU used in the Steam Deck is already challenged by a lot of games at 1200 by 800 so let alone at 1920 by 1200 its GPU only has 512 st uh, stream processors based on the aging RDNA 2 architecture available to it making it much less powerful than any desktop GPUs hmm. even with some help from the frame generation tech used in AMD FSR 3.1 you're going to struggle to get decent frame rate in a lot of uh, the latest game at 1200p with the standard Steam Deck specs. Replacing the screen on your Steam Deck isn't an easy job either and you will also risk voiding your warranty if you do it yourself. And it says there's another benefit to the Deck HD though. One, it, one is it anti-glare coding, a feature that was only implemented on the 512GB uh, version of the standard Steam Deck and one that worth having if you have a 256 gig or 64 gig uh, with a glossy reflective screen the deck hd also offers superior color accuracy with manufacturers claiming it hit 95 percent srgb coverage compared to compared with 67 percent for standard steam deck screen support for the deck hd screen and steam os was spotted by tom hardware on the official valve github page here there's, a, here's, here there's a job called Rebase Deck HD Patches on the latest game scope code, which has been set up to merge the third-party Deck HD patches, pack, uh, patches made by uh, Bilic, Bilica 011 into a SteamOS build. These patches enable the Steam Deck to recognize the display in SteamOS and, it, and is also set up with the correct resolution and refresh rate. If you're already lucky enough to own a Steam Deck, check out our guide, guide to the best Steam Deck games. All right, <clears throat> well, Valve is supporting Deck HD. Okay, I told you updates are always coming in and they're always working, yeah, and they're listening. <laughs> so, Valve is working, man. Um, they're, um, uh, you know they're they're they they're taking their their uh, their user base and their customers serious. So whatever problems they're facing with the Steam Deck, they're trying to address it. You know, so even before the Steam Deck Two comes out, so yeah, or the Steam Deck Two makeup for the things they didn't answer in the first. So they're busy, man. So this Deck HD is getting some upgrade, getting getting some support uh, updates from Valve, and and um and they're adding it to the Steam OS operating system. Oh yeah. So you deck HD lovers will love it. Now, if if you know if you know how to um if you if you've been um like building PCs, then you might then you might know how to do it. But if it, if it's not, but if you but but if you don't, let somebody else who really does 
that let someone with who really got experience of experience of like replacing the screen on your Steam Deck, let them do it. You know? <laughs> yeah, if they're if they're qualified though. Um, <clears throat> yeah, um, the Deck HD is getting um getting some nice updates in this. The people that bought the Deck HD screen when it first came out. Yeah, they're smiling now. <laughs> yeah, Valve is on it, man. So yeah, updates are like this. Now, um, now, now, if, now, if you had bought like, say, like, when Valve had the Steam Decks on sale about a couple weeks ago, when they reduced the price, if you had bought some, bought, bought another Steam Deck, you probably got two or three of them. Now would be a good time to give the Deck HD a go, you know, since you have, since you got a spare Steam Deck laying around, so. Yeah, give it a go, you know, and see, and um, and then take things from there. But yeah, that little handheld packs a punch, man. <laughs> we couldn't find a game the Steam Deck couldn't run, so yeah. Steam, what, what's the screen? What's the screen on this? Let's see here. What's this? Nineteen twenty by twelve hundred. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, you, um, you get a better you get a better picture too yeah so if you got the 64 gigs uh, 256 you're good <laughs> or even the 512 you know or any models if if you feel like upgrading this upgrade if if you got the, the if you got any one of the like the 64 gig 256 512 uh, LCD models yeah go for it anyway I'm gonna leave this video for y'all to enjoy though Nice talking to you people again. Chris, still Star Wars and Star Trek thing. Poor Dark Side. Go. Peace.